And welcome back. The 70th annual Mississippi Gulf Coast Camellia Show is taking place this Saturday. And joining us now is the President Jason Dean. And Jason, it's great to have you on the show. Thanks for joining us. And um, I love camellias and um, I have some in my yard right now that I'm enjoying. And as you see them blooming across the coast, it's just a, a beautiful time. They bring such a nice, bright surprise to winter. Yes, they do. So tell me what people can expect from the Camellia Show this year. Well, uh, we've been growing the last couple of years after, um, you know, kind of like a hiatus with COVID and everything. Sure. So we're going to have a beautiful plant sale this year. We're going to start out at 8.30 in the morning. Then uh, we're asking people who want to enter blooms, they can come in between 7.30 and 10.30. And then we'll close the show for a while so we can judge the flowers then we'll be back opened up at one to four. Oh, great, so people can actually just show up that day and yes. bring flowers that can be judged just and possibly clip them out of win your a yard. prize. Yes. Oh, that's wonderful. And you've brought along quite an array. These are gorgeous and um, different colors. And I mean, they are beautiful. I haven't seen these multicolored ones. I've never seen those actually blooming anywhere. Are they pretty rare? Some of these are newer cultivars. Um, some of them are, are you know, are common in Europe mainly, and they were brought to the United States. So, and some are virus variegated here. This one has a, it doesn't hurt the plant, but it is virus variegated, which mm -hmm. makes white splotches in right. the plant. Right, yeah, I love that. And I see that on several of those and that it's really striking on the darker colors when you have the white spots too. And these are uh, all different sizes. Some of these are pretty big too. Yes, yeah, some of these are Camellia reticulata, which are their larger flowering Camellia. Now people can expect to see these. I know I'm seeing them now. So is it kind of like end of December through January for the most part here in South Mississippi? Some Camellias, they start blooming in October and they kind of filter out. And then some start up in December. And then we have the late bloomers that start mainly in February and run through April. Yeah, okay, well they are gorgeous. And the Camellia Show is coming up this Saturday and, and you can learn about camellias and you could enter your own in the show. And I mean, it's a great way to learn more about these beautiful flowers that are pretty easy to grow here. It's a big year, it's our 70th anniversary here on the Mississippi Gulf Coast. That's right, and it's all happening Saturday. February 3rd from 7.30 to 4 at the Lyman Community Center in Gulfport. You definitely want to take advantage of this because it's quite an event. And again, it's the 70th year, so congratulations. Thank you so much. Well, Jason, thank you so much for joining us today and sharing these beautiful camellias. You're very welcome. Yeah, these are from a friend's yard, right? This is from Mr. Jim Smelly's property in Agricola in, in George okay. County. Yeah, These absolutely. are all grown locally. Yeah, beautiful. All right. We thank him too. Coming up, we are.